Hi, I'm very sure you must have used ng if, ng for, ng class directives in Angular. But today in this quick video, I'm going to show you another directive which you might have not used. So consider a scenario here that you have three divs here. This is one, this is two, this is three. And you need to display one of them on certain criteria. And say, assume that here you have count equal to two. Now, on basis of this count value, you need to display one of them. How do you do that? Of course, there are multiple ways to do that. But here I'm going to show you a directive called ng plural. So here, say ng plural and then initialize that with count property. Then what you need to do, you need to load this in different ng templates. So you can say that, hey, ng template and display this ng template only when that count value is one and put this div inside that. In the same way, you can take this ng template and again, you can say that for this div and we say that, hey, display this when count value is two and then again, ng template and this one would be here where ng plural case is equal to three. So you see that what I have done here, I'm using a ng plural directive and that is initialized with count equal to two. And then we have three templates and saying that, hey, okay, one of these template would be displayed on basis of the value of count. So here ng plural case two should be uh, displayed there. So let's go here and run this application. Here you see that you see that this is two. If you change this to, let's say one, we should be able to get the this is one here printed. So I'm sure now you know how to use ng plural directive. What it does, just apply that and then you don't have to go with else, if and other stuff. And also keep in mind that here, if you look, inspect it, you see that it has only uh, in this is one loaded, not the other container loaded. And once you change this to uh, let's say two, then that should be loaded that another ng. And if you inspect it here, you see that here it is loading that particular uh, template. So I hope you find this uh, video useful. Try to use ng plural in uh, your project. And please do not forget to subscribe Geek97 YouTube channel.